We're back after doing that scan. I scanned the entire computer with the Avast boot time scanner. That was every single file. Any file that was on this computer was scanned. If it was a virus, if it was a Trojan, if it was spyware, adware, Avast should have caught it and should have deleted it. So let's see how it did. Uh, I have no more um, fake system alerts down here. Nothing popping up, no balloons popping up constantly. Those are gone. So uh, Avast looks like it took out some of the rogue antivirus. That's good. If I look at my task manager, um, I can see that my CPU processing is pretty much normal. RAM is low. That's good. Uh, everything looks pretty much normal. Um, let's go ahead and get to the real test here, and uh, that would be adware. Um, it seems like it's really hard for antivirus, anti-malware applications to get rid of adware these days. So let's see how Avast did. On my previous review, uh, the spyware doctor with antivirus, oh, no, there's still a lot of adware in here. Uh, ad adware being served through the browser right now. Um, like I said in my previous uh, review with uh, Spyware Doctor with antivirus, that got rid of everything. So that's the only application I've tested this year that has done everything for me. That's why I promote it on my site. So, um, so we still got pop-ups. If I do a search for antivirus, if I want to go to Symantec, I'm sure this is going to be a redirection. Yeah. I'm redirected to scan.spygarder.com. So Avast did okay. It, it looks like it got rid of um, a lot of viruses, uh, uh, a lot of uh, Trojans, a lot of adware, a lot of the rogue stuff, but it, uh, it leaves a lot of browser helper objects behind, uh, especially in Internet Explorer. So there's a lot of pop-ups still going on, a lot of redirection. Um, they need to work on their adware, detecting and removing especially for uh, um, Internet Explorer. So, uh, and, and I suppose Firefox too. Firefox would be the same thing, just about. So, so Avast, good. Um, it, it, it takes care of a lot of, um, a lot of malware, but it leaves a lot of adware behind, like most other programs do. So, if you're interested in getting something that actually works 100%, so far, Spyware Doctor with Antivirus is the only one I've seen this year. I've been using it on all my clients uh, in St. Louis, uh, and it's saved my butt a couple times this week. So, um, But that's it. Uh, I haven't tested the professional version of Vast. This is just a free version. And for free, you can't beat it. So, Anyway, um, I'm Matt. My website is remove-malware.com. Thank you.